What's going on guys? Welcome to another Stadia News Tuesday. So it has been a little bit dry the past few weeks. Uh, last week we started to get a little bit of news in. This week definitely a decent week for news. As you can see right over here we've got six games announced for Stadia Pro in September and this is definitely some nice looking games here uh, for Stadia. Not to mention we are only around the corner now to a lot of good fall big AAA releases that will be coming to Stadia this year, unlike last year when it launched and games just weren't ready. So taking a closer look at these games, we've got our first on Stadia take on 63 other players in Super Bomberman R Online. It's the biggest Bomberman challenge ever, and they announced this at their Connect. I believe it was in July uh, that it would be coming, and it looks like we're getting it uh, quicker than some people thought. So if you're going to be checking out Bomberman, let me know in those comments down below. So another first on Stadia, Gunsport, which is an action-packed two-on-two competitive challenge. Take on rival teams in rapid-fire trick shot competition on Stadia Pro and looking at this it looks a lot like using guns to play a souped up tricked out version of volleyball basically. So um, new on Stadia we've got Hide in Plain Sight in Hitman, the stylish stealth action game where you use disguise and your wits to infiltrate fantastic international locales. I'm a huge fan of the Hitman series. If you have skipped this on other platforms, you've just never gotten into it, to it or maybe you want to play it again, I have a hunch it's going to run fantastic on Stadia. I will be testing that out and checking it out. Uh, but I highly recommend if you haven't gotten into Hitman and you're on Stadia uh, to give it a go for sure. Uh, new on Stadia as well, something strange and sinister is going on down the street in Hello Neighbor. Can you solve the mystery, survive cunning traps, and avoid a devilishly clever enemy who always seems one step ahead of you and the ai in this game is constantly figuring out what you're up to where lights are being changed noise all kinds of stuff and this guy's always trying to catch you so it's really creepy uh but pretty cool you can check that out so return to the darkness of the moscow subways and battle mutants in metro last light redux so this is the uh, now we're gonna have all of the whole trilogy on pro which I think is great um, I really love the Metro series I've tested it on many different builds I enjoy uh, playing it here on the channel and doing that I will be doing a stadia comparison when this game comes out as well I was slightly disappointed in what the developers did uh, in Metro uh, 2033 when you compare that to some other uh, consoles and builds. Uh, the graphics were just better, and I know Stadia can run all those graphics, so I'm kind of hoping they push this one to it, to those maximum levels for the remaster, but we'll see what happens when it comes out. Definitely Metro Last Light uh, will be awesome to get on Pro. So finally, our sixth game, Team Up With Friends in Ember. You can play it free with Stadia Pro starting September 1st. Uh, since Ember is still in early access, the, the developers are continuing to add to the game to give you the best experience. I got this for 15 bucks, I think, when it first came out as a pro member. Um, it's a fun game, definitely enjoyable. Um, don't hesitate to check out Ember. It can be uh, quite a bit of fun uh, for that. So these will all be available free with Stadia Pro starting September 1st. They'll all also be available for purchase individually in the Stadia store. Now, we've got some games leaving August 31st. So if you haven't claimed these games yet and you're a pro member, we've got Kona, Grid, and Get Packed. They are all leaving Stadia Pro August 31st. So definitely claim, claim those if you have not already. So another one coming here uh, this Friday. This is not a Stadia exclusive, although um, a lot of people think Stadia when they think Windbound. The marketing has actually been pretty good on this game. Uh, you set a course in uncharted seas in Windbound, scavenge resources, battle immense enemies, and encounter ancient magics in a vast world here. Uh, Windbound will be ready to buy on Stadia uh, on the store August 28th for $29.99 USD. So uh, coming this Friday, Windbound, I know a lot of people are waiting on that game, and I definitely want to check it out. I will personally be buying it on Stadia and trying it on Stadia. We'll probably make a gameplay video uh, for that here. So that'll, that'll be pretty great. So also there are some sales going on. They haven't changed much. We were talking about these on the podcast last Saturday. We, it's funny. We were saying we everyone was wishing F1 2020 uh, was on sale. Well, now it is. F1 2020, the 70 edition, the more expensive edition is $38.99. And the, uh, the deluxe edition, the even more expensive edition, is $45.49 for those U.S. prices. So definitely, uh, those are, that's for the pro uh, subscribers. The price is $44.99 and $52.49 respectively for free stadium members on F1 2020. So 
absolutely grab that game um, if you have been waiting to jump in on that fantastic game. Other than that, I don't have a lot of recommendations in the sales. I did say in a podcast, I thought that if you hadn't played Trials Rising yet, or you hadn't played Dark Siders um, Genesis yet, those two games are also fantastic quick pick up and play uh, and very fun games that are on sale as well. So definitely check those out if you want to. So a pretty good week for Stadia. Some nice new games on the way. And like I said, those fall games are just around the corner. So hopefully Stadia can pick up some momentum and keep things rolling. Thanks a lot for coming to check out the video. I really appreciate it. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Give this video a thumbs up and ring that notification bell so you know when I drop new videos. Thanks again for coming to check it out and I'll see you in the next one.